It's August and it's raining here in Southern California. Today is Hurricane Hillary Day and I felt compelled, compelled to see what's gonna happen here at the Disneyland Resort under these proposed conditions. Right now it's no big deal. It's just a regular light rain here, uh, even though it's August, which is unheard of, but it's just a regular light rain, nothing too dramatic. Although it is my understanding that in about a half an hour to an hour, all hell may break loose. <laughs> so that's why we got here at the time we did. Because make no mistake, I wanna be here when the hell is breaking loose. And I'm doing this, by the way, I'm completely ill-prepared for this because I didn't want to bring too much stuff. Normally I carry like a 12-pound backpack with all kinds of camera gear and everything, but I didn't want to, I don't want to carry that thing around and, and, and risk everything getting damaged by the rain. So today I am armed against Hurricane Hillary with nothing more than an umbrella and a, a fuel rod and, and these good looks. <laughs> so I'm hoping that things work out for us this afternoon that we survived this, we're gonna be here for, I don't know, a couple hours, I would imagine, just long enough to find out what the effects are of Hurricane Hillary. And I'll say this, to my recollection, in my 43 years on this mortal coil, all of which have been spent in Southern California, 52 of which have been spent in Orange County, I do not recall there ever being a time when we've had a storm given a name. Happens all the time, happens every year in other parts of the country, East Coast, you know, down South, etc. They name their storms all the time. I don't believe that we've ever had, <laughs> I don't recall there ever being a storm given a name here in Southern California. <laughs> Least of which not in the middle of August. Let's hope that this storm gives them something to talk about in Florida. Because I know all, the, all they're saying is, oh my God, those folks in Southern California, they have no idea what they deal, what we deal with on a regular basis. And you're right, we, we don't. That's why we live here. Thank you very much. That's why I'm never leaving Orange County because we don't get situations like this. Um, but let's, let's, let's have a storm today that we can be proud of, Southern California. Let's have a storm today, let's do it. And I can see that Hurricane Hillary has not deterred my friend Steven. Good day to you, sir. He's ready to go. The Main Street vehicles are ready to go. But that's about it. There's hardly anybody here. Everybody stayed well away. From, it's not even, because this has been known. This has been known that this storm is coming for a few days now. So people have had ample time. Hi, guys. People have had ample time to not come, <laughs> to, not, to cancel their reservations and not go to the park. It is desolate. Normally on a rainy day, there will be a degree of guests here who, who have chosen to stay or come anyway because they, they, they've had a plan and the rainstorm was a bit of a surprise. Uh, but, and so you see a lot of people just kind of hiding out. But I would gather that we could go into some of our, you know, the normal indoor locations and not find it completely bonkers inside like the Golden Horseshoe uh, or the, you know, the gift shops, Main Street Emporium or things like that. Pirates of the Caribbean. Matter of fact, let's go check out Pirates of the Caribbean. Let's see what's happened. Rain is starting to pick up a little bit here. But I think this is just a small pocket. I was looking at the radar on the weather forecast and there's a small pocket hitting our way, but the big stuff is not gonna happen now until two o'clock. No breaks though for Rise of the Resistance. <laughs> this is as healthy a queue as you typically see on a non-rainy day. Look at that, a hundred minutes. Oh, wow. You could literally walk onto any single attraction right now in this park. I could go anywhere in this park right now and walk on, but Rise of the Resistance is a hundred minutes. You know why? Because it's raining and <laughs> they want to be inside. But I'm surprised Pirates didn't have any kind of queue, but Rise, I'll bet you uh, Runaway Railway. That's another one that we can go look into. Matter of fact, we could check the app right now. Okay. <laughs> I guess, I have no idea. Five minutes right now for Runaway Railway. I don't know, man, but just every single person is on Rise, everybody in the park. That's not in front of me right now.
just just sort of drifting about right now. I had a little lunch and uh, just kind of killing time. And I, I'm noticing as I walk around that the park is a little bit busier than it was when we first got here about an hour and a half ago. Uh, and I, I feel like it's because the, the big rain hasn't happened yet. And a few people are starting to get the idea that maybe it's not so bad. Maybe they should go ahead and just go to the park because all the, you know, it's five minutes to get on everything but rise of resistance. And I, I'm wondering, because I'm watching the radar. It's one thing to look at the, you know, the, the hourly calendar and say, okay, it's going to rain 100% chance, whatever. I can deal with rain. But I don't know if they have seen the, owl, the hourly, or I'm sorry, the, the radar. You look at the radar and the, what's happening at 3 o'clock looks terrifying. <laughs> it looks really, really terrifying. And uh, so that's kind of what I'm holding out here for. It's, it's Hurricane Hillary watch at Disneyland and... Uh, we're, we're going to see what she's got in store for us still. We're going to hang out. we got a couple hours to go still, so I'm going to find some ways to kill some time. As usual, Alice in Wonderland closed. Oh, they just say right up. Due to inclement weather. As is the Mad Tea Party. None of these rides over here on this part of Fantasyland function in the rain. <laughs> including Storybook Land on the opposite side. Uh, but Matterhorn is good to go. A lot of brave souls giving Matterhorn a try right now. I'm not sure if I'm brave enough for that yet. I did Matterhorn once in the rain. <laughs> it was not my favorite experience. Just like I did Dumbo that one time. Man, Dumbo was just brutal. That was a terrible idea. I'm, I'm, I, I'm tempted to do something stupid, but at the same time, I'm, I want to live. You know, <laughs> like I, last time I did that, when I did the Dumbo thing, I was I got sick. And I was down for almost a week. And, you know, we're taking a... Uh, a one-day vacation tomorrow. We're going to the zoo on Tuesday, and dri we're driving down to San Diego Monday night, tomorrow night, and going to the zoo. So I want to make sure I'm good for that. Train looks pretty full. <laughs> I'm surprised to see this. Oh my gosh! Wow. <laughs> Put your 3D glasses on, everybody. <laughs> a little water on the lens, but hey, what's the big deal? It's raining out. What do you want? Thanks for joining us on the Disneyland Railroad. For a safe ride, remember to stay seated with your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the train. And please watch your kids. Wow. Where's the boats? <laughs> it's open. Are they running just... The... No. no. Well, there's boats there, but ain't nobody... Ain't nobody coming out. Oh, there's one. Gracias. As we leave Toontown Depot, we get a real nice view of the wow. happiest land of them all, Fantasyland. Look at that. You can see people stepping onto It's a Small World just below us. Where? And Where? Off in the distance, <laughs> majestic Oh, there they are. <laughs> We're now steaming There's forward into the future to a, a land inspired of rocks. by visions of tomorrow, both practical and imagined. Here you'll find Why is there a pile of rocks? There's speed. supposed to be Autopia vehicles there. And but instead there's a pile of rocks. Maybe a glimpse of a Mark 7 monorail. Looks like Autopia is open. There's no guests at all on the platform out there. There's a couple guests in the vehicles down there. I mean, this is dead for even a rainy day. Three and a half ago, this is my favorite part of the journey. Around every bend, there's natural Still beauty nothing. as far as I can see. Is it even raining? I'm not even sure if it's raining right now. Barely a drizzle. myself in Fantasyland, updating you once more. It's about, I want to say like 1.30. I mean, it's raining, but still nothing major, nothing drastic or dramatic. Check the radar once more. And uh, now this is getting interesting. It's now looking like three o'clock. 
that we're gonna, you know, that the big stuff is gonna start hitting our area, you know, Orange County. Except that, you know, we're the blue dot in this thing, and we're splitting that. <laughs> we're splitting the storm. It looks like it's gonna go around us almost completely. There are heavy parts of the storm, the yellow there, uh, in you know, Inland Empire and up in LA, but it's going all the way around us. So I'm not even sure. Even if we wait till three o'clock, are we gonna see anything? You know, uh, major here at Disneyland. I don't know what I'm rooting for, to be honest. I really don't know. What, <laughs> I feel like I want this to be some kind of event, but I'll, at the same time, I'd rather not get dumped on, but we'll see. Uh, in the meantime, you know, like I said, I'm in Fantasyland, so I think I'm going to hit a couple of dark rides. Everything's open except for Mr. Toad's, which is a bummer because I still haven't been on Mr. Toad's since it reopened. But uh, Peter Pan, 20 minutes. Hillary all right I mean it's still just a rainstorm it's not at all windy it's not cold there's no thunder or lightning it's just rain in August so far I mean, don't get me wrong it's something that we're getting rain in August <laughs> that's a thing but uh, yeah I, I you know every time I look at that radar man it's just going right around us now it's later and later in the day where it could even it's bad in other areas. It's bad in like the Inland Empire and uh, LA, you know, up north a little bit. They're, they are getting a lot of a lot of, uh, of rain there, and I'm not sure if they're getting thunder or lightning there, but um, it is just moving right around Anaheim and Disneyland. I mean, at least it's getting it's getting splash zone worthy. You know, you can <laughs> you can make a bit of a mess on your clothes with all this rain. It's getting to that point at least. I've been literally standing out here on Main Street and the Hub for the past, I don't know, half an hour? Just, just waiting, just seeing. And it definitely, is, this is getting to be borderline miserable at this point. But this is not, I think this is as bad as it's gonna get for another couple hours. Five o'clock now, the radar is saying five o'clock. It was three o'clock, now it's five o'clock. Anyway, I just had a great idea. room get out of the rain it's getting worse at least a little bit worse it's still not hurricane Hillary level but uh, try to make <laughs> Hey, <laughs> 
with a bunch of standing ovation. Applause. <laughs> Down there, applause. Everybody stand up. Heading back into Frontierland and then we're in square to see if we can find signs of accumulation here as the rains continue. It's pretty steady right now. It's heavy-ish with, with flurries, like flurries of really heavy rain and then it stops and it gets quiet again. But this is an area of the park. You get a little bit of flooding, like right here. See that? That's a legit puddle. <laughs> That's a super puddle. And I've seen it worse. <laughs> I just noticed that I found another low here. This duck has got a new home. A lot of accumulation here at the loading area for Tom Sawyer. That's an inch. It's flowing, all flowing down from New Orleans Square. You can, you can follow the path there. Feels like it's getting stronger here. Checking in once more on the radar, and it looks like we're gonna hit a brief pocket of storm here in about the next 15 minutes. It's only gonna last for a few minutes, it looks like, and then we're gonna, and then the big stuff starts getting here at around 4.30, 4.45, but again, it looks like we're we're splitting it a little bit. So, I mean, it's we're definitely gonna get more rain, but whether or not it gets to be the super hard stuff, we'll, we'll have to wait and see. But, but so far it's looking like just one big you know, flash at it in about 15 minutes, we'll, we'll stand by here for that. And then we gotta wait around again for another hour and a half. In the meantime, in the last few minutes, the current has grown. Why am I <laughs> sitting here analyzing the current on the steps of Northern Square? I am sick, but the current has grown stronger here, which means that our, our little uh, Lake Sawyer is probably grown to an inch and a half or so. How are things going, duck? Oh, two ducks. They, they have definitely uh, taken up home here for, for a little bit. Meanwhile, there's a bunch of ducks out there just having the best life ever out there in the river. Uh, better than they usually have, anyway. I saw two of them just sleeping. They're just, just sleeping. Meanwhile, Pirates of the Caribbean, five minutes. Indiana Jones is 30 minutes, but look at that standby. They're just eager to get in there. Jungle Cruise is open, it says five minutes but nobody's in the queue. There's like, everybody that wants to ride Jungle Cruise is on a boat right now. There's literally no single guest in the queue that I can see at all. That's wild. You won't catch me in a Jungle Cruise boat right now. No, sir. Inexplicably, Big Thunder is 25 minutes. Also inexplicably, <laughs> the Matterhorn is 30 minutes. I mean, I guess you gotta do something, but these outdoor rides, I don't understand. It's legit raining. And Space Mountain 35, that makes a lot more sense that it should be 35. That's the, that's the attraction you wanna be on right now is Space Mountain. I'd even wait an hour for this at this point. There it is, right on cue. <laughs> I put that up. I made that comment about the little pocket storm coming in about 15 minutes, about 15 minutes ago. And here it is. This is about as bad as we've seen it all day. And it's gone. <laughs> it already it already slowed down a bit. Just... 
funny to see how di people differently approach being in the rain. Some embrace it and just go totally uncovered. Others shrink. Both are correct and neither are wrong. <laughs> it's just interesting the differences. We're definitely approaching <laughs> biblical levels of, of drama here in Southern California. Not only are we getting an unprecedented thunderstorm, tropical storm or whatever, rain in August is simply not a thing. I just heard that there was an earthquake <laughs> in Ojai. It's the end of days, you guys. It's literally the end of days. Once again, I'm posted at the hub, waiting for a squall, and it's arriving again. A little something something happening. There it is. There we go. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. in the Astro Orbiter. Wow, I mean, come on. I love it, that's so great. 10 minutes to five, Fresh Picked. 10 minutes to five and things are, are actually clearing up. I wouldn't be surprised if the sun came out. Like it feels like the sun could come out. Hurricane is trending on Twitter right now because we had a hurricane, quote unquote, and an earthquake at the same time. But it ain't happening here. Uh, there's, it's practically, it's pra it's not even hardly raining at this point. Uh, you, you don't even really need the umbrella. And it looks like I checked the radar once more, or I've been checking it constantly, actually. But uh, it does now look like we're not even gonna get anything in terms of yellow, which is, you know, the heavy rain stuff on the radar, until like nine o'clock tonight. So I'm gonna call it. Mind you, this is just, Anaheim, this is just Disneyland. Uh, I, I feel like it's, it's quite a bit worse in other parts of uh, Southern California, LA, Inland Empire. Looks like they got the brunt of it. Hope everybody's okay out there in those parts. Uh, we're good though here. <laughs> no worries here in Anaheim and at Disneyland. It's pretty much a, a, a standard day, a standard rainy day, I should say. Again, albeit in August. I'm gonna go home put on some new socks, get some dinner, and get to work. Thanks for watching, everybody. Thanks for joining us on this uh, adventure with Hillary. I hope you guys enjoyed. Follow us on Instagram at underscore Fresh Baked, on Twitter at Fresh Baked Disney, that's Fresh with no E, and on TikTok at Fresh Baked Disney. If you like our show and want to show your support, please do consider joining our Patreon campaign at patreon.com slash Fresh Baked. Otherwise, thanks again for watching, everybody. We love you. Be safe out there. Be kind to one another. Fresh bacon.